So today's video is going to be a lace front wig and this is by Bella Lace Wigs and it's actually one of my beautiful subscribers wig site. So make sure you check out BellaLaceWigs.com. I'll post all of her information below along with any of her social media and contact info. So she sent me this beautiful virgin Brazilian straight lace front. It is a 13 by 6 and the unit is called Zaza on her website. It is 100% unprocessed virgin Brazilian hair, natural color. You can get this in the inches of 16 to 30 and has adjustable straps, has combs in it, and I did so in an elastic band. Now, for one, let me tell y'all, this lace wig came out beautiful, like I'm saying. Of course, I did bleach the knots and I pre-plucked some of it, but girl, the lace will melt in your skin, honey, okay? Like seriously, the lace will melt in your skin. So, also, of course, you guys can tell I did actually style it off camera. You guys have seen me style a lot of wigs, so, you know, I didn't think I would want to bore you with that. But if you want to see me start styling again on camera, please let me know. And I'll definitely, you know, do that for you guys. So, as you guys see, I'm just cutting off the lace from the front tool perimeter. And I always use small scissors. I do see people using eyebrow trimmers or bigger scissors. I prefer the smaller scissors, but I do want to try out the eyebrow trimmers just to see how that works. So, pretty soon I'll give that a try. So, the wig fits good. There's just a tiny bit of overlapping of my ear, which I will definitely fix right about now. And all you need to do is take your rat tail comb and you want to make sure that you part directly above your ear so that way the lace will lay flat and it'll also look more natural. So go ahead and just cut that off. Don't be scared, girl. It's not going to harm the wig. It's not going to take away from it. It's actually going to make it fit more comfortable. And it's definitely going to allow it to lay a whole lot better. Now, as for the stocking cap that I already had on, I actually had did a video prior to this. So that's why I had on the stocking cap, the ball cap method. You know, I really don't do that, as you guys can see in a lot of my videos, because I don't really like to keep my wigs on for too long. And plus, I really don't need it because it'll make my head kind of like hot. So the longest that I'll keep a wig on is probably like three, four, or five days. So I don't really use the stocking cap method. But for this video, I did have it on. Now, this part right here, you guys already know, sideburns, honey. Need a little sideburns. A girl needs sideburns. Everybody needs sideburns. But you don't have to do the baby hairs or the wispy hairs. And I'm just going to cut off the little pieces of lace because every little bit does make a big difference in your unit. So keep that in mind. If you got a little piece of lace showing, you definitely want to hide it. And I'm just going to adhere it with my Got To Be Glam Force hairspray. This, this hairspray is like the bomb to me. I love it. I use my blow dryer on Cool Girl and then I'll press it down with my rat tail comb and I'm good to go. Throw on a scarf at night and this baby will hold for like, I would say like, four to five days the only thing that you'd have to probably tack down again would be the sideburn hairs but other than that the wig will definitely stay intact now i can't really remember oh yes i actually do have this unit in 22 inches in length you guys already know how i love long hair not too long but 22 inches is long enough for me i'm not really sure about the density of the unit i can't really remember but i'll definitely leave it below for you guys but i'm very impressed for the lace with this unit and also the quality of the hair is really good as well so i definitely will give bella lace wigs that she definitely came through with this unit so i would highly recommend her she is in the united states for one and like i said this is one of my beautiful subscribers so i always try to show love and support for each one of my subscribers now 
Now to curl the wig, I did use a one inch barrel curler and I just left the curls alone. I didn't pin curl it or anything like that. I just curled, curled it and styled it and then I just put it back in its bag that it came in and that was it. But I did forget to show you guys the one important thing on this video because I really think like her packaging was amazing especially for a young entrepreneur. As you guys can tell her boxes are amazing. I like the fact that it's just very chic. I do love the color of the satin bag because that is the theme color in my house gold and silver so I really do like that and she just put a lot of attention and care into her packaging but look this wig is stuck down and I'm gonna give it the thumbs up now I'm just gonna cut those wispy hairs away and you know sculpt them down Now being that this unit is a lace frontal, you can do many different styling options with it. Of course there isn't lace in the back, but you can definitely still put it up in a bun hun if you know how to or a ponytail. And the reason for me spraying the hairspray onto my toothbrush is because I don't want the hair to be hard hard. I just kind of want the roots of it to be a little bit hard. Plus it also helps with the sculpting instead of you just spraying it all over. And sometimes sculpting the baby hairs or the flyaways can be a little bit tricky and it will take me some time, sometimes. Now do you see how that hair just like melted? The lace is melting like butter, baby. Like seriously, this lace really did melt. Like look, girl, you cannot even see that lace. I'm saying though. No. Now I could have did the sideburn hairs a little bit better and that would have been with the use of gel but I really didn't want to put any gel on the hair because I really think it's gorgeous. The curls came out so nice in the hair. This is definitely a very pretty unit. how bouncy this is now I don't normally do straight straight hair because to me sometimes straight hair doesn't hold a good curl and it always feels thin so for me straight hair is not one of my favorites but this came out so gorgeous the curls in this came out gorgeous the density the fullness the volume of it it's very pretty you can like I said you can definitely pull this back in a low ponytail a bun you will definitely have to just kind of finagle and finesse the back because it is a lace front but girl use your imagination when styling your wigs and you will definitely achieve the look that you desire. And just a little hairspray to just style it and just hide those little bit of flyaways and give it some, you know, hold cuz girl, I do not want my curls to fall. Isn't she cute? I'm saying Bella Lace Wigs, you guys. All of the info will be in the description box below. I'm saying no. This came out really gorgeous. Like I said, I just bleached it and pre-plucked it and I just put some purple shampoo on after bleaching it so that way there was no brassy tones in the unit. I let that sit on for like two hours and voila, she was good to go. So I will definitely leave all of the information below for you girls, you know, check her out. Make sure you support one of our fellow YouTubers. 
and this is how long she is she's very lengthy now keep in mind it depends on how tall you are but i'm like 5 3 so i'm not that tall but it looks 22 inches is long on me and like i said you can definitely pull her up in a ponytail this one looks really good in a ponytail if you press her even more she'll get even flatter on the top but zaza zaza you know what i'm saying zaza And that's how she would look in a ponytail not that neat because you know I didn't have plans but I just wanted to show you that you could if you wanted to put her up in a ponytail or a bun you can definitely achieve that you may want to press the hair a little bit straighter but just for the sake of the video I wanted to show you guys you know but she's gorgeous I love how free-flowing the hair is and just how full it is especially for a straight wig So you guys, I'll leave all of the information down below for Bella Lace wigs. Just remember, this is the Brazilian Virgin Human Hair Straight, and the inches that I have are 22 inches. If I remember the density, I will also leave that down below for you guys, and this unit is called Zaza. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I love you, and I'll see you soon. Bye.